May I help you, traveler? Hmm. Something drew you to my shop. Something powerful. Ah, you have a keen eye. The Alicorn Amulet is one of the most mysterious and powerful of all the known magical charms. Uh, I'm afraid this is far too dangerous. Would you like that gift wrapped? My little pony, my little pony. Tons of fun! A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? Don't be scared, little friends. Twilight is wonderful with magic. Anything happens to them, Twilight, so help me. Aw, uh, don't worry, Fluttershy. Twilight's magic has gotten a lot better since she accidentally crushed me and Applejack with a giant snowball. Of course she's good with magic. Twilight's great with magic. I guess I just don't want my little friends to be scared. Oh, oh look how scared they are. <laughs> I promise, Fluttershy, nothing bad will happen to them. I know. That's all for now, little ones. Maybe we can practice again later, if Fluttershy says it's all right. Your magic has really improved since we came to Ponyville Twilight. Princess Celestia's gonna love it. Thanks, Spike. I have to be at my best when she arrives with the delegates from Saddle Arabia. I can't believe she's trusting me with the entertainment. Twilight, come quick, it's an emergency. Here. Well, well, well. If it isn't Twilight Sparkle. <gasps> Trixie. What's she doing here? You call that great and powerful? <laughs> Ooh, she's Rainbow Wobble now. Yeah. <laughs> Unfinished business. My magic's gotten better since I was here last. And I'm going to prove it. Me and you, a magic duel. Winner stays, loser leaves Ponyville forever. Forget it. I'd never make a deal like that. <laughs> Your choice. <laughs> doing this why because you humiliated me after you showed me up with that Ursa minor I became a laughing stock everywhere I went I was laughed at and ostracized I even had to take a job on a rock farm just to earn a living a rock farm hey you're lucky a rock farm would take the likes of you <laughs> Now, 
Now I want revenge. And I'll just keep casting spells till you agree. <laughs> Well, what do you say? <laughs> All right, Trixie. Let's duel. Excellent. <laughs> if I lose, I won't set hoof in Ponyville again. But if you lose, you're the one banished from this one horse town. <gasps> <gasps> something out. Just take care of each other. And keep an eye on Trixie. There's something strange about her. Twilight? Mm. <sighs> <sighs> it's impossible. How could Trixie know such advanced magic? Without Spike, I can't get a message to the princess in Saddle Arabia. So who else do I know who understands strange and powerful magic? Your tale of woe upsets me so. No wonder you're dour. It's an abuse of power. I don't know what to do, Zakora. I feel like I've abandoned my friends, but I can't take her on horn to horn. If you train with me, so good you'll be, I'll show you the way to make sure she won't stay. You'll train me in magic? But she was doing age spells, weather spells, you name it. When it comes to magic, it would be tragic if some pony licked me, especially Trixie. You really think I can beat her? Mm-hmm. Okay, when do we start? You two, hurry up with my throne. And you, how long do I have to wait for my applesauce facial? Forget it, Trixie. I ain't doing nothing till you let Twilight come home. <laughs> uh, uh, oh. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. Just make it stop. <laughs> I thought I told you to dance. Trixie's cruel magic is ruining Ponyville. No! So, the pony has to help us. Ah, 
No noise, no sound, no din, no fuss must interfere with your focus. Unlearn what you have learned. Only then can victory be earned. Uh, Trixie is the highest level unicorn. <laughs> <laughs> There is much, much that I can teach, but the answer you need may still be out of reach. I'm sorry, Zakora. I'm trying my best, but I can't stop thinking about Trixie. There was something different about her. It's like she's gone from high and mighty to mean and nasty. Your thinking needs a readjust. Total concentration is a must. Pinky, I can't find anything that describes the kind of magic tricks he's doing. Oh, there must be something. Twilight has every magic book there is. Um, I think I may have found something. Yes! It's time for us to consider our futures in this new trixie led Ponyville. Um, this sounds an awful lot like Trixie's magic. She wants me to grow apples with no peels. Now, how the hell am I supposed to do that? Um, there's a picture here of that necklace Trixie <laughs> wore. It's called the Alicorn Amulet, and whoever wears it is blessed with untold... Hey, every pony, look! This book has a picture of Trixie's necklace! It's called the Alicorn Amulet, and whoever wears it is blessed with untold powers! But if you read a little further, you'll see... Even though it provides great power, it also corrupts the user! Yes, but, um, you can't... You can't just take the Alicorn Amulet off her neck! It has a magical lock! Trixie's the only pony who can take it off! Maybe we could... We need to get this information to Twilight. She'll know what to do. But how, how... If any of us try to leave, Trixie's magical force field will tell her. Maybe we should... I've got it! Trying to sneak past the force field will be impossible without help. But I know who's got the goods to get into those woods. It, it must be... Fluttershy! What? What do you say, Fluttershy? Can you handle the mission? No! I'll crack under the pressure. I'll snap like a twig! It's perfect! Fluttershy will sneak out of Ponyville and find Twilight. But, but I... I... Design for a dangerous mission outfit. <laughs> Pull, you fools! Some ponies set off the magic force field, and Trixie intends to punish them. But wouldn't it be faster if we had some wheels? The great and powerful Trixie doesn't trust wheels. Now pull faster. Yeah, I'm telling you, Snips. She's getting weirder and weirder. Stop! You there. What are you doing? Why is she so mean to us? Yeah, I miss the days when she was just a fraud. Oh, oh dear. Rarity's dangerous mission outfit is ruined. Guess we better go back. <laughs> Okay, you're right. I need to be brave and find Twilight. Oh, you found her? She's in the Everfree Forest? Oh, this is me being brave. I want to be brave at home, locked in my closet with my teddy bear. I can't believe I didn't recognize the Alicorn Amulet. And the more she uses it, the more it will corrupt her. But how am I supposed to beat that amulet? My magic's not good enough. Twilight Sparkle, much work have you done. You learned all of my lessons, all but one. If Trixie's tricks have you in a fix, you must mix your magic and use the six. Mix your magic, use the six. 
Mixer and Magic, use the six! Use the six! That's it! Zakora, you're a genius! Now we'll need to get you back inside Ponyville, Fluttershy. This better not be another false alarm, or the great and powerful Trixie will... You! What's the matter, Twilight Sparkle? Not enjoying your exile? I know about the Alicorn Amulet. I know you cheated. Cheated? What? Yeah, and I thought you might want to see what a real magical amulet looks like. Zakora gave it to me. It's from beyond the Everbree Forest. And it's way more powerful than your measly little alicorn amulet. Ha! Nothing's more powerful than the alicorn amulet. And no pony's more powerful than the great and powerful Trixie! Care to put your amulet where your mouth is? How about another duel? Why should I? I already beat you. That's up to you, but I guess you'll never see the totally awesome magic from beyond the Everfree Forest. Come on, Zakara. Wait! Okay, okay, you're on. A second duel. Start with a simple age spell, shall we? Let's. Snips, snails. <laughs> An oldie but a goodie. <laughs> now, let's see what your little charm can do. No problem. Um, Applejack, Rarity, could you help me, please? Huh? Huh? So you can do an age spell, big deal. That's... that's impossible! That's nothing. Duplication spell. Ever see one pony play ten instruments? This, this can't be! Ooh, one more. I can turn a mare into a stallion. Yep. Trixie, looks like my amulet is more powerful than yours. Hey, give it back! <laughs> With this amulet, I shall now rule all of Equestria! <laughs> <laughs> Witness, my subjects! Gaze upon an ever greater and powerfuler Trixie! <laughs> I don't need that old alicorn amulet. I have this! <laughs> Stop it! That, that, that tickles! <laughs> tickles? That was supposed to make you writhe in agony. This amulet is defective. Give mine back. Sorry. This is going back into hiding where it belongs. By the way, Trixie, the amulet around your neck, it's one of Zakora's doorstops. But uh, how did you do those spells? No pony can do those spells. You're right. Not even me. Zakora taught me so much about magic while I was in exile. She even taught me when not to use it. My magic alone wasn't powerful enough to take on the Alicorn Amulet head to head. So I needed to use a different kind of magic. The magic of friendship. I also knew that the only pony who could get the amulet off your neck was you. But what about the pony with the ten instruments? That's not magic. That was just Pinkie Pie. 
I could do. I treated you and your friends so horribly when I was wearing that alicorn amulet. I just couldn't control myself. You can forgive me, can't you? Hmm. Sure. Oh, good. Don't you think the great and apologetic Trixie is the most magnificent humble pony you've ever seen? day today. Certainly something we're singing about. There's music in the treetops, and there's music in the vale, and all around me music fills the sky. There's music by the river, and there's music in the grass, and the music makes your heart soar in reply. like that before. It was like a little slice of heaven. With ice cream on top! Fluttershy, I cannot believe your spectacular voice isn't part of the Pony Tones Quartet. Um, well, I... Especially since you're having us perform for your Ponyville Pet Center fundraiser tomorrow night. Well, you see, I... This simply must be rectified. You must share that stunning voice at the event. Yeah! You'd be there on stage, basking in the hoplites, the center of attention, a shining star, with every pony staring at you, judging you, jealously noting how they could be way better than you. Why wasn't it them? Why wasn't it them? And then, when you choke, they'll turn on you, becoming a seething, angry mob, and you'll be horribly humiliated and never able to show your face in Ponyville again! Pinkie Pie! Don't be ridiculous! Aw, but I'm so good at it! Come, Fluttershy, you will join the group making the Ponytones Quartet the Ponytones Quintet! No. Pardon me? I love the Ponytones. I'm one of their biggest fans, but I do not want to perform with them. Why not, Fluttershy? Well, you see, I... I have... Um, I... I have... Spit it out! I have... stage fright. <gasps> is it contagious? Stage fright isn't a disease, Pinky. It just means that Fluttershy is scared to perform in front of every pony. 
I'm very thankful the Pony Tones are singing at the Pet Center fundraiser, and I'm really looking forward to the performance. But I'll be watching safely from the audience. Well, I think it's a terrible waste of an exquisite talent. But I understand that you're not comfortable. Thank you. Oh, Angel's right. We better get going. There's a lot of work to do before tomorrow's event. Let's run through that again. Bum 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 ba da ba da dum bum bum ba da ha bum 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 ba da ba da bum 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 ba da ha. Every pony is saying you should learn to express your voice, but if talk doesn't seem like it's the answer, luckily you have a choice. When you find you got the music, you got the music in you. Find you got the music, you got the music in you. Thank you, Spike, but this is an ensemble. Nah, the rest of you are pretty good, too. Oh, I thought you were all amazing, Pony Tones. <laughs> Thanks, Fluttershy. Now, Pony Tones, I want you all to rest your voices for the remainder of the day. We'll do a final run through tomorrow before the big event. All right? Yep. Sounds great. Oh, Rarity, the Pony Tones are really going to make the Ponyville Pet Center fundraiser so special. Thank you so much for helping me help the animals. Oh, yes. It is wonderful when a plan comes together without any sort of drama, isn't it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Morning, Fluttershy. Good morning, Pony Tones. Actually, we're the Pony Tones minus one tone. Big Mac is inconveniently late. <laughs> well, there you are. Have I not told you about punctuality? Ah, I don't want to hear it. tonight with only three voices. Why not? It would take rearranging all the music and we just don't have time. I'm sorry, Fluttershy, but I have no remedy for this situation. <gasps> of course, a remedy. Follow me. I can cure this pony that is horse, but it will take a longer course. Uh, come again. Mm. I can mix a brew that will work just right, but it cannot heal him by tonight. Oh, no! Uh, where are we ever going to find a deep voice to replace Big Macs? <laughs> 
Pardon me, Zakora, but this is no laughing matter. We need a bass voice for the harmonies to work. Without it, the performance will be ruined. Please, forgive my strange elation, but I was not laughing at your situation. Then what? Remember when you pony folk stumbled into poison joke? Miss Fluttershy had an unusual change, deepening her vocal range. I don't want to talk about it. Yes, yes. Your voice became really low, making it sound like... <gasps> Flutter Guy! With these leaves, I can mix a brew, creating the same effect on you. Sakura, that's fantastic! Yes, I'll do it. I'd do anything for the animals. Why, you'd even appear on stage! <gasps> oh, except that. I just can't bring myself to sing on stage in front of every pony. What if you sang not in front of every pony? Huh? What if Big Mac was on stage moving his lips while you're behind the curtain singing his part? It would be just like singing in your house. No pony would know it was you. Even still, I just don't think I could sing in front of... You must! For the animals! <laughs> oh. Okay, then. Mix it up. Just like we practiced. <gasps> Good evening, citizens of Ponyville. I want to thank you all for coming out tonight and generously supporting the Ponyville Pet Center. Thanks to your kindness, pets are finding loving homes, and we are sure to meet our fundraising goal. Where's Fluttershy? Probably hadn't. You know how much that pony hates the spotlight. So, with no further ado, please welcome the Pony Tones! <laughs> Outside and you see, see the, the sun shine. Something's in the air today. today. Sky oh, is clear and you're feeling so fine. Everything's gonna be a okay. If you listen carefully, on every corner there's a rhythm playing. Then it happens suddenly. The music takes you over and you'll find you got the music, got the music. Your voice, but if talk doesn't seem like it's the answer, luckily you have a choice. When you find you got the music, you got the music in you. Find you got the music, you got the music in you. Got the music, got the music in you. And you sounded better than ever, Big Brother. <laughs> Fluttershy, you were on the wrong side of the curtain. You totally missed the show. Uh, just like a true professional, Fluttershy was backstage making sure everything ran smoothly. And it was perfect. That was fantastic, Ponytons. My new puppy and I thought it was super duper crazy good. Why, thank you. <laughs> And we were wondering if you would consider performing at my daughter Zipper Will's cute senior. Will you? Will you? Oh, we'd love to. Uh, when is it? Next week? Next month? Tomorrow. Tomorrow! Oh, gracious, I'm terribly sorry. That's just much too last minute. Oh, no. Well, I understand. Oh, Rarity. We can't disappoint that sweet little filly. Are you sure you're up for it? When you find you got the music, you got the music in you. Find you got the music, you got the music in you. Got the music, got the music in you. Amazing! 
amazing, Pony Tones. And it would be even more amazing if you could perform at my ribbon-cutting ceremony tomorrow. Oh, Mayor, we would love to, but... Um, <clears throat> will you excuse us for a second, Mayor? Certainly. Don't worry, Fluttershy. You don't have to perform again. But we wouldn't want to disappoint the Mayor. Well then, Mayor, the Pony Tones will happily perform at your ceremony. Trot outside and you see the sunshine. Something's in the air today. Sky is clear and you're feeling so high. Everything's gonna be a okay. Want to disappoint the spa patrons? If you listen carefully, on every corner there's a rhythm playing. Then it happens suddenly, the music plays. You wouldn't want to disappoint the school ponies. We must talk to you. Big Mac's voice is all better. Yep. Now you can bathe in the poison joke antidote and sound like your lovely self again. It's just, I didn't know that last performance was my last performance. Fluttershy, stop! Oh, would it be okay if Fluttershy sang for you one last time? Yep. Hey, find it. Oh, my, you can find it in your heart. Yeah, find the music. Yeah, yeah. It's in you right now. Oh, yeah. You can find the music. Yeah, yeah. I love the music. Yeah. <laughs> Big Mac, you got some explaining to do. Turkey call? Yup. Treasure voice? Yup. Is the core remedy? Yup. Not quick enough? Nope. Needed a deep voice? Yup. Poison joke? Yup. Flutter guy? Yup. Better now? Yup. And that shy filly was living her dream in the shadows because she couldn't bring herself to come into the spotlight? Yup. Well, for car's sake, let's go! Buttershy? You in here? Yes. I'm here. That was totally unbelievable! I mean, the curtain came up and there you were, singing in front of every pony! And you know, I don't think any pony was jealous, because there certainly wasn't an angry mob, but it must have been horrible standing there on stage, all eyes glued directly on you! It's like you were living your own personal worst nightmare! <laughs> it was... <laughs> what? Too much? <laughs> what Pinky meant to say was that you were really great. Wait, didn't I say that? Hardly. Whoops. You were great! <sighs> you totally blew my mind. <gasps> Incredible. Though, no offense, you kind of sounded like a dude. <laughs> uh, you're a great sounding dude. Well, thank you all. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Because I'm never going to sing in front of any pony ever again. <gasps> no, no, no! Are you kidding me? Can we please stop running? I just don't understand 
why, Fluttershy. After all, you're the one that wanted the Ponytones to sing for every silly thing that was requested of us. You mean, you knew I really wanted to perform? Of course I knew. Oh. And for all her babbling, Pinkie Pie was right about one thing. Only one? When that curtain fell, and every pony saw you singing, you lived your worst nightmare! Was it really that bad? Yes! Well, what was so bad about it? The thunderous applause? The praise for your fantastic singing? The screaming fans! There's music in the treetops, and there's music in the bear. so bad. And you didn't look completely petrified by the fact that we're all staring at you at all! How do you feel? Surprisingly, okay. Fantastic! Because the Ponytones have been booked for the Apple Family Zap Apple Jab Extraordinaire! Oh no, I couldn't do that. Have oh, fun, Seriously? I'll get there someday, but for now, Baby steps, every pony. Baby steps. Sometimes, being afraid can stop you from doing something that you love. But hiding behind these fears means you're only hiding from your true self. It's much better to face those fears so you can shine and be the best pony you can possibly be. 